we would like to welcome everyone back to our channel. I hope you have a wonderful day ahead of you. There is a persistent light of hope that appears in the middle of the turbulent seas of uncertainty that we find ourselves navigating. This beacon is the call to strengthen our spiritual resilience and get ready for the trials that are still farther ahead. Faith illuminates our path through the darkest of times. Just as a lighthouse guides ships safely to dock in the midst of the darkness it brings during the night. There is a loud call to arms for the soul that can be heard in recent messages of urgency and prophecy. The atmosphere is filled with a sense of urgency, which is not only a warning of disaster that is about to occur. Rather, it is a clarion call to welcome change with open arms. The fundamental fabric of our existence is set to undergo a profound transformation, and we are standing on the brink of a momentous transition that is about to take place. In the voices of prophets and messengers, the warnings are unequivocally communicated to the people. They warn of impending doom and of catastrophic occurrences that have the potential to reconfigure our reality in ways that we are not yet able to completely fathom. In spite of these gloomy projections, there is a glimmer of hope. The assurance that those who respond to the call will be protected and guided by the Almighty. It is of the utmost importance that we strengthen our spiritual foundations in the face of hardship, firmly establishing ourselves in the unchanging love and mercy of our Lord. Maintaining our connection to the divine will allow us to weather the challenges that lie ahead, just as a tree that has deep roots is able to resist the most intense storms. To be spiritually prepared is not limited to merely adhering to conventional procedures. Rather, it encourages us to establish a relationship with the divine that is alive and breathing. We prepare our hearts to absorb the limitless grace and knowledge that come from the source of all creation by praying, meditating, and reflecting on sacred scripture. This opens our hearts to these things. We discover consolation and fortitude in the words of the Blessed Virgin Mary, who is both our Father and our Mother in heaven. She brings to our attention the unending love that emanates from the heart of her cherished Son, Jesus Christ, and makes us remember it. She tells us to turn to Him with unflinching trust in times of uncertainty and difficulty. For he is the light that illuminates our way by illuminating the road that we should take in the darkness. We need to cultivate a spirit of humility, service, and compassion in the same way that a gardener tends to the soil, where the seeds of faith that have been sown within us are being nurtured. In a world that is enveloped in darkness, we become beacons of hope and agents of transformation when we manifest the teachings of Christ in our daily lives through acts of love and kindness. This is because we are the messengers of Christ. In light of the fact that we are on the verge of entering a new era, let us respond with bravery and conviction to the call to spiritual arms. With the knowledge that we are not traveling alone, let us make sure that we are mentally and physically ready to face the obstacles that are still to come. With the embrace of divine grace and the communion of our brothers and sisters in faith, we discover the courage to persevere through adversity and the hope that tomorrow will be better than today. Psalmist, let us seek refuge in the shadow of the Almighty, relying in His everlasting love to carry us through the darkest of nights. Let us take refuge in the shadow of the Almighty. Furthermore, as we navigate the uncharted waters of the future, may our faith serve as a guiding beacon, bringing us even closer to the shores of heavenly calm and unending joy that are yet to come. The Holy Rosary is a potent instrument that has been bestowed upon us from the skies above when we are in the midst of the shadows that are encroaching upon our globe. During times of uncertainty and despair, it serves as a guiding light full of hope, a stronghold of faith, and a source of divine comfort. As we face the impending shadow of global darkness, let us turn to this holy prayer with renewed passion and trust in the capability of this prayer to transform our lives. Rather than being only a string of beads, the Holy Rosary is a spiritual weapon of enormous power that has the ability to protect us from the attack of evil and to lead us safely through the storm. Our voices join in praise and intercession for the salvation of humanity as we enter into communion with the hearts of the faithful all around the world through the rhythmic repetition of prayers that are a part of this practice. The loving presence of Jesus Christ, our Savior and Redeemer, envelops us in the stillness of spiritual thought, and we find that we are surrounded by it. We find peace and strength in His limitless love as we contemplate over the mysteries of His life. 
beginning with his miraculous incarnation and culminating in his magnificent resurrection. This brings us even closer to his divine heart. Every time we repeat the Hail Mary, we are endowing ourselves with a potent weapon that can be used to combat the forces of darkness that are attempting to mislead us. We ask the protection of the holy angels and the intercession of the saints with firm faith, relying in their assistance as we traverse the challenges that this world has to offer. God bless you. As we go through this storm, may the Holy Rosary serve as a safe haven for us, a source of inner peace in the midst of the upheaval, and a fountain of spiritual nourishment and strength for us. We should not merely go through the motions of praying. Rather, we should engage in a meaningful experience with Jesus Christ and His Blessed Mother, allowing their love to permeate our hearts and bring about a transformation in our individual lives. When we are confronted with difficulties and difficulties, let us resort to the Holy Rosary with fresh devotion, finding refuge beneath the mantle of our Most Holy Mother. Because we are able to find solace, strength, and the fortitude to confront whatever difficulties may come our way when we are under her watchful eyes, let us, as we pray beside Jesus on the dusty roads of Galilee, reflect with reverence and amazement on the mysteries that he has revealed throughout his life. For the sake of persevering in faith, May we find inspiration and encouragement in the lowly incarnation of Jesus Christ, in his profound teachings, in his suffering passion, in his beautiful resurrection, and in the entrance of the Holy Spirit. Allow the presence of Christ to shed light on our way and dispel the shadows of uncertainty and dread as we cling to the light of Christ in the face of the impending darkness. It is because of him that we discover the genuine source of hope and redemption the light that shines in the darkness and which the darkness is unable to overpower. We should put our worries and concerns into the loving hands of our Heavenly Mother as we wrap ourselves in the protecting cloak of our Mother in Heaven. We should have faith in her maternal care and intercession. Because she is our leader, we are able to find tranquility, protection, and the knowledge that she is always by our side for support. Let us be steadfast in our faith, united in our prayers, and strengthened by the Holy Rosary as we face the immense evil that closes in on us. As a result of the fact that its sacred secrets provide us with the power to triumph over every challenge and the grace to persist until the morning breaks and the light of Christ shines forth. In times of difficulty, may the Holy Rosary be our constant companion, our anchor in the storm, and our beacon of hope in the midst of the darkness where we find ourselves. With open hearts and sincere devotion, let us accept this priceless gift with the belief that it has the potential to bring us ever closer to the heart of Jesus Christ, which is the place where we can find genuine peace and joy. Taking refuge in the Holy Rosary as a potent weapon against the encroaching darkness, let us, in conclusion, heed the call to deeper devotion and spiritual preparedness as it is presented to us. Let us move forward with self-assurance knowing that we are not traveling alone, but are accompanied by the loving presence of our Savior and His Blessed Mother at every step of the way, faith as our shield and prayer as our sword. Let us march forward with faith. I want to express my gratitude for staying until the very end of the video. How do you feel about the topic that we are discussing today? If you would like to receive notifications whenever there is a new video, please leave a comment below. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel and turn on the bell button.